in this lecture we'll compare memory project and apb project so this is the ram one port memory project block diagram with handshaking signals okay so this is the clock reset valid for sending request this is the right signal right data address ready to give response and this is the read data you know clock purpose reset purpose and uh, write purpose write tells whether it is reading or writing write data address read data so now we have to discuss about valid and ready previously uh, we used enable now in the enable place two signals came valid and ready so in that case enable is one memory is ready to respond for reading or writing but now here whenever we want to get the data or we want to send the data first how to send the request so this valid is to send the request so when this receiver is uh, ready to give the data so it will respond yes i am ready ready to give the data or take the data so when these two two signals this uh, request and response together are called handshaking signals okay so if we compare this with uh, memory uh, apb suppose this uh, clock can be p clock p reset p valid p write p write data p address p ready p read data if we take apb2 and there is a select signal also okay so here select signal is not included so we cannot say this is apb2 and if we take apb3 along with the select we need p error also so ready is there but p error p select not there na so we cannot say apb3 and p prod p strobe also not there so we cannot say apb4 okay but just we can get some idea by doing this project to do apb project because to this uh, if we just add error signal uh, select signal select and error signal both it will become like apb3 na okay so by doing this project uh, you can get idea to do apb project also okay that's the comparison 